10 times people did not realize the worth of their discoveries. 1. In 2006, a Filipino fisherman accidentally discovered a pearl that was so enormous that it weighed 34 kilograms. With such a rare object in hand, the fisherman decided to keep it as a good luck charm under his bed. Ten years later, in 2016, he authenticated the pearl, and to his disbelief, it was worth more than $100 million. He was literally sleeping above a million dollar treasure for almost 10 years. 2. Rick Norsegian, a California construction worker, stumbled upon two beat up boxes of items at a garage sale in 2010 and purchased them for $45. He later found out that the items in the box were actually 65 glass plate negatives captured by the famous nature photographer Ansel Adams. They were worth $200 million. This is like finding a sack of gold in the trash. A team of experts verified that these are the works of Adams beyond a reasonable doubt and were thought to have been lost at a 1937 fire in his Yosemite National Park studio. Three. A scrap metal dealer in the U.S. Midwest once purchased a golden egg for $13,000. He actually thought that the egg would be worth a little more as it was made from gold. But little did he know that he had unknowingly stumbled upon a rare Fabergé egg worth a whopping $33,300,000. It turned out that this rare Fabergé egg was owned by the Russian Tsar Alexander III almost a century ago and was lost during the Russian Revolution. Four. In 1989, a Philadelphia collector liked the frame of a painting in a flea market and bought it for $4. Since he was interested in the frame alone, he discarded the painting as soon as he got home. But to his surprise, he found something hidden behind the painting. Folded in the size of an envelope was a rare first printing of the Declaration of Independence. The collector had no idea but decided to keep it out of curiosity. It was only in 1991 that he had the copy authenticated. It was sold at an auction for $1.6 million. 5. A 73-year-old Californian woman bought a painting at a thrift store for just $5 in 1992. She bought the painting for a friend, but when the dinner table size painting didn't fit into her friend's trailer, she put it out for sale in a yard sale. It was there that an art collector identified the painting as a Jackson Pollock, which was actually worth millions of dollars. A fingerprint on the painting helped experts establish authenticity. Although the woman received an offer of $9 million for the painting, she announced that she would not accept anything less than $50 million for the painting. 6. In 2010, a three-year-old British boy, James Hyatt, was playing in a nearby field with his father's metal detector when it suddenly started beeping. James ran to his father and both of them started digging at the exact spot. To their amazement, they found a 16th century gold pendant that had the image of the Virgin Mary engraved on it. Experts estimated the pendant to be worth $4 million. 7. During a game of Masterpiece, an auction-based art game, an Indiana man saw a painting in one of the game cards that looked similar to a painting he had at his home. He had been using the painting to cover a hole in a wall at his home for years. Back home, he sent an email to Kennedy Galleries with digital images of the painting that he had, and voila! It turned out to be worth $1.25 million. The painting was Magnolias on Gold Velvet Cloth by the famous 19th century American painter Martin Johnson Heed. 8. In 2010, Randy Giharo came across a tintype photo of a group of people playing croquet. He paid $2 for the photo. Little did he know that he had become the owner of a rare photograph of Billy the Kid, the infamous Wild West outlaw, and his gang, the Regulators. Giharo was contacted by Jeff Ayeo, a National Geographic producer who heard about his plight in verifying the photograph. Giharo offered him help in return for permission to make a self-funded documentary depicting Giharo's journey to authenticate this photo. When the photograph got authenticated, National Geographic became interested in the documentary and it was released as Billy the Kid, New Evidence, in 2015. The $2 photograph is now worth $5 million. 9. 
In 2010, Andy Fields, an English businessman, bought five paintings for $5 at a Las Vegas garage sale. He discovered a hidden sketch inside one of the paintings when he went to reframe them. The sketch was that of singer Rudy Valley of the 1930s. But the intriguing part was that it was made by Andy Warhol, the famous visual movement activist. A signature on the back of the sketch helped to verify the authenticity. The sketch was valued at $2 million. 10. A New York family was at a garage sale in 2007 when they picked up a decorative Chinese bowl for their living room for just $3. What they didn't realize is that it was actually a 1,000-year-old treasure. The 5-inch diameter bowl was made of ceramic and had a unique sawtooth pattern on its outer body. The bowl was eventually purchased for $2.2 million in a Sotheby auction. According to experts, the bowl was from the era of the Northern Song Dynasty of China, 960 to 1127.